Hey, it's Christina with Tina Girl Travels and today I'm super excited to show you the PackSafe Eco 18 liter anti-theft backpack that PackSafe sent me to try out. Now I did a review a while back on the Eco 25 liter and you can check that out on my channel and I'll add a link to that video at the end of this one if you're interested in seeing the differences. Now let's dive into the PackSafe Eco 18 liter and see how it compares. If you watch my channel, you know I'm a big believer in PackSafe products. I haven't found anything that even comes close to the quality and the features that PackSafe builds into their bags. I'll add links for both the Eco 18 liter and the Eco 25 liter below in the description. If you're new to PackSafe, this is a company that is driven to reduce their impact on the environment. They use things like recycled bottles and recycled fishing nets to make their products. The PackSafe Eco Collection is their most sustainable collection yet by using almost 100% recycled materials and components. There are so many details to this bag that I'm excited to show you. Let's start with the shoulder straps. I love the adjustable length of the shoulder straps. If you're a tall person or a bigger person, this backpack will work for you. Same thing if you're shorter or a smaller framed person, this bag will adjust to your size. The straps are padded and covered with a breathable mesh where it touches your chest, which is great for taking this bag on day trips in hot places or on hikes. Right at the top, you'll notice these elastic belts. These are for holding a water tube for a hydration pack. I'll add a link to one of those below in the description for you to check out, and we'll have a look at where that would sit inside the bag in a second. Both sides of the shoulder straps have a handy little plastic ring. This feels very high quality and I can't imagine it breaking easily. You can use it to hook a carabiner or whatever you might want to hang from there. As we move down the straps, we come to the adjustable sternum strap. These slide up and down for your comfort. It really does make a difference having this done up as you walk through your day. It relieves a lot of stress on your back. Next, we come down to the adjustable portion of the strap, and that's just a simple weave through buckle. But here's where we come to one of our first anti-theft features. The strap is cut resistant. It's called a carry safe slash guard strap with Dyneema. Dyneema is a fiber that is 15 times stronger than steel. That's what's running down the sides of the straps. On the end of the strap, you're going to find the pop and lock system that PackSafe is famous for. This is a great little detachable clip and I'll show you how it works. You can see this little latch here that has a little open and close lock on it. When it's in the locked position, you cannot push down on the release lever. Simply turn the lock to the unlock picture, press the knob and slide the casing off. You can now lock the strap around a chair at a restaurant, around a tree or a fence post, or even secure it to your other bags. There's also this small circular hole on the back that you can slide a travel lock onto for more security, just like this. This is a water repellent fabric that is really easy to keep clean. But if you do need to spot clean the bag, just use a damp cloth with a mild detergent and rinse with plain water on a cloth. While we're looking at that fabric, this is a good time to mention the Exo Mesh Slash Guard built right into the entire front of this bag. It's hard to describe it, but it feels a little like chicken wire protecting this bag from being slashed. You can't see it, and you would probably never notice it, but it's there for your protection. This space is perfect for things that don't need to be locked up. It would fit a light jacket, maybe a rain poncho. I want to show you the zipper, and this feature is slightly different from the Eco 25 liter. There are two zippers on this pocket and the safety feature on this one is called a secure zip tab. The zipper slides through it like this, making it hard for someone to just sneak into your bag. So let's have a look inside the main compartment. It takes up the entire height of the bag. This is where the bigger stuff can go, including up to a 13 inch laptop. Now this is another area where the Eco 18 liter and the Eco 25 liter differ. The 25 liter can hold a 16 inch laptop. 
The back of this pack is padded for extra protection. Now this pocket is also where you would keep your water bladder if you were carrying one, but obviously not at the same time as your laptop. The water bladder tubing would feed right through this top hole here and through to the outside of the bag. This would also be a great spot to feed an external power source for your cell phone should you need that. Over top of this pocket, you'll also find an RFID safe pocket for your passport or your credit cards. On the front of this compartment, you're going to find two pen slots, a zippered pocket with a key ring and a clip on a cord. And if you're like me, I always lose my keys at the bottom of my bag. So I love these little ring clips for things like that. This is a nice space. Let's have a look at how it locks. This compartment also has two zippers. So those zipper pulls slide onto the rhubarb sport locking system. So you're completely locked up with this bag. Place the zipper pulls over the bar. You'll slide the plastic clip in place and slide the little lock plate in place to secure it. Of course, PackSafe isn't going to leave you there. They've added one more level of protection should you need it by adding a slot right here for a travel lock. This is a great feature if you're visiting high pickpocket areas of the world, like the Eiffel Tower in Paris or the Trevi Fountain in Rome. I've had friends pickpocketed in both those places. You may want to add the extra layer of protection, but just by having a pack safing and using its built-in safety features will likely be enough to deter any pickpockets roaming around looking for an easy target. On the outside of the bag, you'll find two very useful large water bottle pockets. I actually love the thin stretchy fabric with the elastic at the top. It keeps everything secure. The pockets are perfect for water bottles and umbrellas. And I really love that this bag is super streamlined, which is perfect when you're traveling on a train or a plane. Pulling this bag out from under a seat or in a confined space is easy. There's nothing getting caught on anything. It comes in several colors, black, which is the one we've been looking at, tidal teal, canyon, and gravity gray. And they look great on both men and women. The PackSafe Eco 18 liter measures in at 16.9 inches high by 10.6 inches wide and 7.5 inches deep. It weighs in at only 1.61 pounds and it's made from recycled polyester. Let's have a look at how the Eco 18 liter and the Eco 25 liter compare. Here they are side by side. The only thing that changes is the height and the weight. The Eco 25 liter adds just under three inches. So instead of being 16.9 inches on the 18 liter bag, the Eco 25 liter is 19.7 inches high. The weight changes slightly as well. And there are a few differences in the bags themselves. Turning them around, here you can see the strap lengths and the removable hip belt circumference. So there are some differences between the 18 liter and the 25 liter. So be sure to watch my video on the Eco 25 liter. I'll link it here to the end of this video for you to watch. Be sure to check out the links I've added below to our favorite PackSafe products. There are so many options to choose from. You'll find something that's perfect for your trip. I hope you enjoyed my video and I hope I was able to help you out today. Please give this video a thumbs up and consider becoming one of my subscribers so you'll be the first to know when I release my next video. Thanks so much for watching Tina Girl Travels and I'll see you again soon.